Particle accelerators, such as the Large Hadron Collider at CERN, have revolutionized the field of particle physics and opened up new avenues of research into the mysteries of the universe. But did you know that these cutting-edge technologies also have connections to ancient myths and legends, such as the Tower of Babel? The story of the Tower of Babel appears in the Book of Genesis in the Bible and tells of a group of people who sought to build a tower that would reach to the heavens. According to the story, God was displeased with their arrogance, so he caused them to speak in different tongues, making it impossible for them to complete their tower. The Tower of Babel has been interpreted in various ways throughout history, with some suggesting that it represents humanity's quest for knowledge and power. Some scholars have even suggested that the story of the tower is an allegory for the creation of the first particle accelerator. In the book The Physics of the Impossible, physicist Michio Kaku explains that the Tower of Babel may have been an ancient particle accelerator. According to Kaku, the tower was likely built to generate energy and create a beam of particles that could reach the heavens. The construction of the tower would have required a great deal of engineering knowledge and technical expertise, similar to the construction of modern-day particle accelerators. While the connection between the Tower of Babel and particle accelerators is speculative, it is clear that both represent humanity's desire to understand and manipulate the forces of the universe. Particle accelerators allow scientists to study the building blocks of matter and explore the fundamental laws of physics, while the Tower of Babel represents humanity's quest for knowledge and power. They may also allow far more sinister effects and have been linked to the creation of black holes, with the intent of using primordial chaos, the building blocks God used to create the universe, as a means of generating magical energy that can be transmuted by occultists into a myriad of strange powers, and some claim even allow the sorcerer to cheat death itself. Could this be the reason why the Bible is so adamant about God's displeasure with witchcraft and sorcery? In conclusion, the story of the Tower of Babel and modern particle accelerators may seem worlds apart, but they share a common theme of human ambition and the desire to understand the mysteries of the universe. Whether the Tower of Babel was an ancient particle accelerator or simply a cautionary tale about human hubris, it continues to captivate the imagination and inspire new ways of thinking about science and mythology.